continues to make waves in his return to Oakland. Recently, he said wide receiver Amari Cooper needs to get back to his Pro Bowl form. This comes after Gruden cut former All-Pro punter Marquette King because of his issues with his personality. Gruden has already released Michael Crabtree and publicly questioned Marshawn Lynch's commitment to football. So, Cube, have you been encouraged or discouraged by Gruden so far? Uh... I don't know why he got rid of the punter. I mean, that's the move that <laughs> threw me. I mean, that's the move that made me the maddest. Like, mm. yo, I thought he was a great punter. I thought, you know, you never see a punter with personality. So, exactly. I mean, you know, he's only on the field one play, you know what I mean, every yeah. every now and then. So, <laughs> how much could he really disrupt things? And he was getting the ball inside the 20, which is yep. the most important thing. Over 50-yard punt. So, it was... It was I don't really understand that one. Um, you know, Gruden is cool. I, I just feel a little bit for Derek Carr. You know, this is his, going to be what, his fourth mm -hmm. coordinator, you know. And, and so, you know, how can he really become the man we expect him to become when he's always switching coordinators? So here we yep. go again in Oakland with another regime change. You sound discouraged. Well, you know, I've been through this. Yeah. You know, I've been through this, seen it. Seen different coaches come. So you should be immune to it. Mm. What you talking about, man? Did you say something over there? Mm. <laughs> uh, she'll be used to y'all. She's a little bronco. You know what? Yeah. <laughs> but anyway. Uh, Got that orange. But, to him over there. you know, John is a great personality. Yeah. And, you know, if he can get that locker room, then they'll play hard for him. And we'll see what he can do. Mm. I've been discouraged. What I don't understand is. John, he does he realize that he's not an analyst anymore and the things that he think or the things that he say in private doesn't have to be made public? You could have gone to a, what you said to Amari Cooper, or Cooper. Now, I don't know if he said it or not, but if he did, he could have kept that private. Do you actually think so? Amari Cooper went because, you know what, this year I think I want to get hurt. I want my performance to slow down for my rookie year. So, yeah, I think that's what I want to do. Of course, of course, Amari Cooper wants to stay healthy. You could have gone to Cooper and said, Coop, I really need you in the offseason program. Mm -hmm. We're going to get you a ton of balls. In this offense, you're going to be the Z receiver. Go check with Jerry Rice. Go check the Sterling Sharps. Look at the guys that played that position in this offense. You're going to have to be durable. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to make, I'm going to need you in the offseason program. You could have kept that private. Every conversation that you have with a player, it doesn't have to be made public. It's almost like, He's on air, and he's like, I got to say this. No, keep it private. I'm telling you, you're going to lose it. I guarantee you. He keeps this kind of behavior up. Mm. He'll lose a lot more players than he gained. Mm. Trust me. You ever heard of sending a message to a new locker room? He got email. Mm. Mm. That's what you enjoy like so much. And you don't have? No. Mm. You don't need it. Mm. Tell me. Talk to me, Skip. Mm. You don't got to tell. You don't have to go on TV and tell him, tell my Shannon ain't working hard. I wish he'd show up on time. You can talk to me, Skip. Mm. I did not say that. <laughs> Shannon works hard. He's just always wrong. I can't fix that. But I'm here to assure my man Cube to my left that it's going to be okay in Oakland because this is the right man at the right time at the right place for the right team because Chucky has returned. And he was a great fit the first time, and he's going to be a great fit the second time. I'm with you. I did not love the Marquette King cut. I didn't get it, except that John Gruden is trying to get everybody's attention. And I don't know if he talked to him or not. We speculated yeah. about that. But at least you got to give him a chance. Right. Because Marquette King, didn't. He, he wasn't one of those punters trying to become a social media or media right. star. He just enjoyed a good – Inside Pinning the, the ball down the, inside the five or ten yeah. yard line. Often corner yes. kick. Who, who, and who don't want a fired up punter? I yeah, mean, I know. Come on. You need some, some yeah, kind of because, emotion. Why yeah, not? He didn't try to take over the locker room after the game. He just did that on the field. But he was really good at his job. So I didn't get that one except I just know Gruden is trying to get everybody's attention. And one way to get attention is to just lop off ahead right away. He just said, okay, he's gone. And I'm going to call out Amari, and he kind of called out Beast Mode. I, I, effectively. As, he gave, as he picked up that million-dollar option. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My thing is, yeah, if you want to have a team meeting, you can say, guys, okay, this is what this I, 
things are going to be different. Mm -hmm. Moving forward, this is my expectations. I don't care how it was mm -hmm. in the past. I don't care about your former coaches, your former position coaches. Moving forward, this is the way we're going to conduct business. Mm -hmm. I believe you can talk to players without trying to make it so fun. <laughs> look, I, all that Chuck in it. Look here, there's nothing better than the first. I love child's play, but the first one, when they started coming with child's play, his mom and his dad and child, uh, child's play, he gets married, the bride of child's play. Come on, Cube. You know it wasn't any good. Mm -hmm. yeah, I, w I wasn't with them. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know. I mean, this move, um, to me, it, it's the jury's still out on it. You know, uh, Skip is very confident, but the jury's definitely still out on it. You know, Were they deliberating? Huh? That she deliberating the jury. Mm -hmm. She about to bring that verdict back. Mm. After this year, she I had know that when verdict. they play the Broncos, they're going to put in work. Mm. You won't bet if we go, I bet you run it. I bet run you it. them glasses. No, 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 no. I can't bet these now. Woo. I can't bet these. Bet you them cufflinks. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's that fake watch. <laughs> oh, I bet you the link. Yeah. I bet you them cufflinks. I bet you the cufflinks. We're going to run through y'all like no. party going north. No. If we go uh, two and fourteen, the two teams we're gonna beat is the Broncos. <laughs> <laughs> you know y'all not beat. We all we own y'all. No. When Peyton was there, y'all won like one time. Ran the floor with y'all. Tebo beat the brakes off y'all. Tebo beat the brakes off y'all. You got the nerve to be up here talking about Tebo. Beat the mm. brakes off y'all. Mm. So what that say about y'all? No, we got you. Don't worry about it. Because mm -hmm. yeah, you got a big mouth, that don't mean you're right, man. <laughs> that is correct. When last y'all y'all Q, when last time y'all won anything? When we beat you, I want them cufflinks. Hmm. So I, want. I mean, and them trophies that y'all got the Wait, triplets, they get old. Aren't you the guy who's been laughing at Case Keenum all year? Just a backup? Now he's your it, your backup. It's, so, it's something that yeah. when you come to that blue and orange, yeah. things happen. Oh, really? They said like they did for Trevor Simeon. Did no, 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 Peyton came. They say Peyton was done. Mm. He got there. Peyton had three great, great years for us. And the fourth year was down by Peyton Sanders, but Super Bowl 50. Mm. Who got Super Bowl 50 trophy in the trophy case? Not the Raiders. When mm. the last, last time y'all won a Super Bowl, Q? Mm. It's been a minute. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll get back there. Mm. When's the last time you won one? Super Bowl 50. Mm. <laughs> we about to help we out when we cooking. Mm. We cooking, Q. About to be 53. No. Hmm. We're gonna beat y'all. As long as we beat y'all, I don't care. Hmm. You ain't gonna have you, you're not gonna have no brand. Raiders right. win the Super Bowl before uh, the Broncos. Huh? That's a fact. That is not a fact. Yes. Hmm. Hold on. When did y'all get when did y'all get did y'all sign Bill Belichick? Hold on, let me see my phone. They you normally alert me when breaking NFL news come in. Hmm. Y'all ain't sign no Bill Belichick. Y'all got Tom Brady. That's a Super Bowl winning coach. That is correct. That got a haircut just like the owner. Mm. Both of them go to super cuts. <laughs> yeah, stop playing. They don't even go to super cuts. They uh, go to bowl cuts. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Appreciate you coming in. Be sure to check out the Big Three Draft next Thursday.